Good morning and welcome back to the vlogs. So today is Sunday. It's a couple of weeks before Mia's second birthday and today I'm going to drop Ingemar off at the gym and I'm taking Mia off to Costco and Ikea because we're going to start getting prepared for her birthday, look for some presents, have a little shopping list. We need to get a few things for the prep of the party and I'm also going to get supplies for baking her cake. So I'm going to take you guys along and show you all of the things that we do in the run up to her birthday party. Right, first stop, Mummy and Mia are gonna go to Ikea and have some lunch. You gonna cross the road? Here's little Mia in your favorite place in the shopping trolley. Go and say hi to everyone. We missed it, Mia, didn't we? It's quite difficult to get food and have a baby at the same time. Mia, what are you doing in Mummy's handbag? Get your pocket money later. <laughs> the first thing we're gonna pick up are some napkins. I think we're just gonna get plain white ones because the green aren't the kind of color that I want and there's nothing else that's very exciting. So we'll just get some of these. Oh, we've got nowhere to put this in. Mm, didn't think that one through. You're good company. Right, we're looking for 15G. It's not one of them. Mm. 15G, oh, it's gotta be around here. Okay, we're looking for the tent. <laughs> Where's the pop-up tent? There's the house, at least there's that. Oh, little chair. No, oh, this is not G. Oh dear. Oh dear. This is not going so well. Hmm. There's another section of 15G, but we seem to be very much out of luck today. So far, that's all we have. <laughs> oh dear, happy birthday Mia. Hmm. Okay, so the problem is that so many things are on containers and they don't have a clue when they're gonna actually leave to come to Iceland. So we're just gonna have to wait on quite a lot of her birthday gifts. Never mind. Okay, we've just arrived at Costco and it's absolutely heaving. I'm not sure, this is probably a really stupid idea and I should just come through the week, but we're here. So I'm gonna go and give it a try. All we need is flour, Pretty much all we need is flour. The queues are crazy. Let's get out of here and go home, Mia. <laughs> it's not worth it. We have all the flour. Pizzas, some start, and we can get baking. Ingmar has taken Mia and Kjartan. Kjartan is our nephew. They've gone out for a walk. They've gone to the botanics and to feed the ducks. Okay. <laughs> and I am at home tidying up and getting ready for tomorrow because tomorrow is Mia's second birthday. How do we have an almost two year old? And we are planning a pretty exciting day and we're gonna be vlogging it because I think it's so fun to share these kind of videos and to keep them to watch back over time and to watch with her. So we will be taking you along on the day, but I'm gonna show you what I'm doing in the run up to the big day. We're having a kind of family day tomorrow on her actual birthday because it's a Sunday and also because she's had an eye treatment recently. So we just want to give her a bit more time to recover and feel back to herself before we have a party. So next Saturday, we're having her birthday party with all of her friends and all of the other mums and dads and some family members. So that would be really special. So it's nice to have her to ourselves this year because we were traveling last year and it was lovely to be away, but it is nice just to kind of be a bit more calm at home where I can be creative and make her lots of fun things for her birthday. We've done a bit of a countdown. So Mia is two and two more sleeps. That's gonna change to one tonight. And I got her a chair from the secondhand shop and I kind of did a, a little DIY project on it. So I've made it kind of suit our colors and style and everything. It's not really that exciting, but <laughs> a little chair for her desk. So that was one of her presents. She's got her Peppa Pig. There's obviously a theme. She loves Peppa Pig. So she's got her Peppa Pig balloon. With Mia's presents, we have bought her a couple of things, just small things. I am a big fan of recycling, reusing, and trying to adapt things. And especially living on a really small island like Iceland, where 
A, it's very expensive here, and B, there's not a huge amount of variety. There is IKEA and then really expensive designer shops. And some of the items are beautiful, but I just don't want to spend that much money on something that she's just going to play with. And if she trashes, then great, because she's had fun with it. But it's probably just going to be used for a short amount of time and then passed on to the next kid or passed on to her friends or whatever. So spending money on kids' toys is something that I kind of feel not really a necessity. Obviously I want to buy her nice things and all of that kind of stuff. So what we've done for her birthday is actually try our best to recycle, reuse and kind of repurpose items. So I have managed to buy her some nice second-hand things from the charity shop. We've got one close by to us which sells a lot of furniture but also a lot of toys so I've managed to get quite a few good quality bargains there. I don't really want to be going shopping in shopping malls and to um, big retail stores because obviously you want to distance and here in Iceland we are admittedly in a bubble from the pandemic and we're very lucky but at the same time because we're in a bubble people aren't really respecting the two meter rule and everything is kind of normal here and so it is scary because the border is open but there's no real protection and people aren't wearing face masks or anything so I just want to avoid as much as I can so I've been to the charity shops and I've also been using Facebook because Facebook marketplace is good but also there are some free groups or secondhand Ingemar thinks I'm hilarious and he, he just laughs because I'm constantly getting something and then going and picking it up from whatever house which is interesting to nosy at people's houses. Today I picked up a tent which I wanted to get Mia from her auntie from Ikea but Ikea was closed for a while and then they haven't had new stock arrive because it's in a container somewhere in the ocean we're not quite sure what's going on with that so I don't know when they're going to be restocked anyway. So I managed to get her the pop-up tent with the tunnel as a second-hand free item which I'm going to take upstairs and give it a good clean and disinfect the whole thing tonight this evening when she's in bed. I also got some other toys which are very heavily used but she's going to use them for such a short time and she's going to wheel around on them hopefully and just probably trash them more and have a lot of fun with them and then we don't need to be so protective over items because we either paid a very small amount for them or we didn't pay anything and so it doesn't really matter which makes it just makes you kind of a bit more relaxed about them but yeah I'm going to take those things upstairs and Ingemar's going to laugh at me and then I'm going to clean them and then I'm going to take her to the beach to see her friends and we're going to go on a treasure hunt and it's going to be great fun. This is the tent and I also got the tunnel. It's in pretty good condition so I'm just going to give it a good disinfect. I also have a mirror here. <laughs> I think Mara is going to laugh at me. Um, I'm just going to try and use that over her table. Inside the fridge I have just iced her cake. So that is ready and we've got cupcakes in the back there. It's got gold glitter on the top of it. Out here drying is the cake top that I made for her. So. It's obviously Peppa Pig. Um, I will now insert the footage of me making that so you can see.
We're gonna wipe off this. <gasps> and it's one more sleep. Do one. One more sleep until you're two. Yay. Are you guys done? Exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Good That was really good. Ready? Ready? Go! You're a rascal. Can you stop? No, they're not going to go. Beaming. That's not my dragon. A baby girl. A little one year old. And you wake up, you're gonna be two years old. Kiss from mommy. Night, night, little one year old. We'll see you in the morning when you're two. Night, night, baby girl. Night, night. <laughs>